All right, folks, but you guys, idiot, we are back. Playing criminal cases on Facebook, World Edition. Case number one, go to Europe in crisis. Prince Albert was killed by Enid Grimshaw. However, it sounds like she was blackmailed to do it. Excellent work finding Prince Albert's killer ace, but I have a hunch this investigation has only just begun. Remember Eden told us that someone blackmailed her into killing the prince. We need to find out if she's telling the truth. And I've got a feeling that Prince Albert's murder is related to the recent attacks across Europe. Well, sure thing, boss. Come on, Ace. Let's return to the crime scene. We need to. Dear Trooper Ace, Her Majesty demands to speak to you. Oh, you again? Can't you guys just say hello? So what to do first, Ace? Chit chat with the Queen or pound the London pavement? Uh, let's not go to the Queen because she seems to be not our biggest fans so let's not do that keep calm and head to London that was funny green dress handbag bicycle let it be cupcake satellite dishes like over here kite mailbox pumpkin stack of books Torn paper and daisies. Boom. Nice. Nice. Nice work. We think this torn paper is relevant. You should put it back together before this London rain dissolves it. It is true. It is true. I'm excited also to see uh, where we're going next. Sir Trooper Ace, after your noble service uncovering our grandson's murder, we feel we can trust you with another royal mission. Count Rupert has gone missing. He's always been something of a scoundrel, but after Prince Albert's killing, the royal family cannot afford another scandal. You do know that we're a police agency, right? Not some kind of VIP babysitting service. Besides, Rupert tried to have us arrested. Let him stay lost. But yeah, but my guards night my guards spent all night looking for him. We're afraid he might have been kidnapped, or worse. Fine, last thing we want is another dead prince. Where was Rupert last seen? In the castle's jewel house, that greedy rascal is forever trying on the crown jewels. Well, Ace, you can find a needle in the haystack, so a prince in a jewel house should be a piece of scone. Piece of scone, that's, that's pretty good. Alright, let's see if we can put this together real quick. Oh, we're gonna have to dust it off too, it looks like. Ooh, Enid Grimshaw, interesting. Hmm. That paper you restored has its name on it. This is exactly what we were looking for. But the rain's got to the rest of the text. You can retrieve the writing? Great, let's go. Yep, I've got some skills. Send this off. It's probably gonna be like a six hour one. It's a nine hour one, great. So the message you found in the streets, you read Eden Grimshaw, we will kill you and your entire family. Ace, you understand what this is? It's the blackmail message which got Enid to kill Prince Albert. Come on, let's see what DuPont can work out from this paper. Uh-oh, it's part of that Illuminati stuff. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. Alright, where's Prince Poopert? Hanging back. Jewelry box. Course. Scroll. Sphere. Fleur de Lis. Salamander. White cross. Catapult. Closed book. Heart. Arrow. Misclicked on one of them. Hmm, nice druid box that you found in that castle. I bet there you there's something interesting in there. Let's go through it. Yeah, why not? Hopefully it's a nine hour thing that we gotta do. I love it when they package them back to back. Oh, yes, yes, let's find this. Oop, looks like a ticket. Where did he go? Globe Theater. 
So what'd you find among those jewels? A theater ticket? And Count Rupert's name on it? So while all the guards were hunting for him, Count Rupert was at the theater. Man, just when you think someone can't get more self-absorbed. Let's go get, let Rupert know that all the Queen's horses and all the Queen's men have been looking for him. And they couldn't put him back together again. What's up, jerk? Where the heck have you been, Count Rupert? What are you doing hiding in this theater? Oh goody, one's been discovered. One came here to escape that ghastly castle. Grandmama has been forcing one to practice royal waving. You're worried grandmother's the one who sent us? She thought you'd been kidnapped. Oh, poppycock. The only thing she worries about is her reputation. Now leave me alone. One is very busy with jolly important things. You seem nervous, Rupert. Is something wrong? Nothing is wrong. One, um, I just can't find my mobile phone. My bloody valet lost it. Here, take this money and go see a show and leave me alone. All right, fine. Am I gonna help you with the phone? I'm not gonna help you with the phone, awesome. Well, anyways, I'll see you guys later. This has been Pitching Ace 88. Au revoir. All right, folks, Pitching Ace 88, we are back. Like Criminal Case on Facebook. Finish this off. Sack me, blue eyes. I see you have a new crime to investigate. A crime against art, against history, against... Get to the point, DuPont. That page you found on the London Street was torn from a thousand-year-old manuscript, and they defiled it further by writing on it. The manuscript in question is an ancient text regarding a long-lost cult. You see that symbol? That is their mark. Wait, that symbol looks familiar. Where have I seen that before? Ace, that's right. Brother Klaus. He has a symbol on his necklace. He's in a cult. Why does that not surprise me? You think that means that Klaus wrote this message? Let's go find out. Uh-oh. Illuminati. Scur, scurry, scurry. So, Brother Klaus, you blackmailed Enid Grimshaw into killing the prince? But don't play coy. The symbol on the note matches your necklace. You come to accuse me again of murder? And this time because of my necklace? How dare you? This is a symbol of my ancient order. Oh, really? So, are you saying you've never seen this note before? That, that paper, this cannot be. That paper is from the manuscript, but it hasn't been seen for centuries. Give it to me, it is a holy relic, even with that message scrawled on it. Not so fast, Klaus. Someone in your ancient order wrote this note, and we're gonna keep you in custody until you tell us who it was. So it looks like Brother Klaus' organization was behind the prince's murder. Let's keep him in custody for a while and see if it makes him talkative. As for Chris Prince Charmless, <laughs> he seemed pretty nervous about his lost mobile. Do you think he's hiding something? Hmm, if we find Count Rupert's phone, maybe we'll discover what he's up to. Good idea, we last saw him at the theater. Let's go back there and find out what he's up to. Prince Charmless. Dun dun. Oh, brother. Got all my stars. We are ready to go. Go to the theater stage. The theater, the theater. What happened to the theater? All right, let's do this stuff. So skull, treasure chest on a gramophone, treasure chest, crown, snake, drum, UK flag, Blowing horn, leer, here, piano, microphone, here. I missed it. Oh, no. oh, so you found Count Rupert's phone. Nice work, buddy, but look, it's locked. Think it's treason to unlock it? <laughs> I won't tell if you won't. Come on, let's unlock this phone. Let's go see, let's get to the bottom of Prince Poopert's. Cell phone. Pretty phone. <laughs> Instead of pretty simple, it says pretty phone. That's that's pretty clever. Uh, there we go. That's got to be a seven. Yep. It's got to be an eight. Nope. There we go. Not the worst. Not the best. 
Good job, you got Count Rupert's mobile phone unlocked. Let's get to Elliot and see what Rupert's hiding from us. Let's. All right, what do you got to say? Nine hours. All right, well, I will see you later. Pitching is idiot. Au revoir. All right, folks, Pitching is idiot, we're back. Let's finish this off. Well, well, so Archer's hacking into a royal phone. I wonder if that's high treason or just the regular kind. I will be a sport, Elliot. We'll never have another opportunity to find out what Count Rupert's up to. Well, it's gonna cost you. Here's the deal. I'll tell you what's on the phone if you clean my office every week for a month. Deal? Fine, you've got a deal. You were right. Count Rupert is up to something. His online banking account shows he's got a wire transfer two days ago for over one million pounds. Oh, well, that's got suspicious written all over it. Where did the money come from? Well, that's the thing. It was sent from the European Central Bank. Why are they giving money to royalty? I don't know, but I bet I, I know a guy who does, Archibald Gilchrist. He works for the European Central Bank. Let's go have a chat with him. Come back soon, Archer, and bring a mop. Dude, I don't know why you gave in to that guy. I would not have given in to him. I hope he gets better. He seems kind of like a jerk. Ah, Senior Trooper Ace, a pleasure to see you. Care for afternoon tea? Ugh, only a few days in England and I'm already sick of tea. Well, why not a burger instead? My bank's private chef just made some and I know you Americans love them. Private chef? We thought your bank was short on money, yet you paid Count Rupert around a million pounds. Oh, bugger. You found that out? It was meant to be a secret. You see, with Prince Albert dead, the bank needs new royal support. Otherwise, we're done for. So we paid Count Rupert to say nice things about us in public. That's all. Honest. How many nice things can one million pounds get? Come on, Ace, let's get out of here, and I'm taking the burger. Of course you are. Do you really think that Gilchrist paid Kent Rupert all that money just to say nice things about the European Central Bank? Kind of sounds crazy. Yeah, you're right. Maybe we can get the truth out of Rupert. We need to take his mobile phone back to him anyways. Alright, let's see what he has to say. Right, let's go talk to Count Poopert. I just enjoy saying that. It's funny. We thought you might want your phone back, Count Poopert. Oh, you found it. How glorious. Maybe one was wrong about... Hey, you unlocked it. One ought to have you horse whipped. But yeah, I wouldn't do that, because then we just have to tell your grandma mama about the big fat bribe you took from Archibald Gilchrist. No, no, don't do that. Please, I'll tell you everything. Gilchrist, Gilchrist gave me the money, and all one has to do is use Royal's reputation to support a yes vote in some referendum. What referendum? No idea. One doesn't care for politics, but one cares deeply for cold hard cash. One's told you everything. Now please don't tell Grandma Ma what I've done. I'll even make you honorary nobles to keep my secret. Here, have Albert's royal uniform. This guy's an idiot. Well, we can't promise anything, Pooper, but you need to start behaving like a proper prince. No more dungeons and bribes. Promise? One promises. Talking to yourself in third person, I'm not a huge fan. Ace, there you are. I've been looking for you all over the place. I have bad news. We've had to release Brother Klaus. But what? But his ancient order is responsible for the prince's murder. Our evidence against him isn't strong enough. Besides, someone paid for a very expensive lawyer to re represent him. Where does a mad monk get the money for a big lawyer? Something stinks with the guy, and it's not just his filthy robes. Yeah, we've got bigger things to worry about, Ace. We're nowhere near to working out who is behind the recent chaos with the red referendum, and in, with chaos and with the referendum in only a few weeks. Referendum? That's what Count Rupert was talking about. What's the vote for? With all the violence and bloodshed in Europe, the European Parliament has arranged a referendum on uniting Europe under one government. No more Britain, Germany, or France. Just the United States of Europe. The United States of Europe sounds like a big deal. Why is Archibald Gilchrist supporting it? Yeah, and I've got a bad feeling about Gilchrist, too. We'll keep an eye on him whilst Ace is away. Away? Where's Ace going? We're sending you to France. Dupont has just heard on his historian grapevine that the manuscript had been found at an auction in Paris. What? 
You get to go to Paris, beautiful boulevards, amazing food, and stunning women, and I'm stuck in rainy old London? Cheer up, Archer, have a cup of tea. Oh, he's gonna be stuck there, so we're gonna be getting Carmen. That's cool, I'm excited, super excited. Oh man, this is nuts. All right, let's grab all of our burgers because we got all the stars before we completed this. Let's unlock. Oh, and then we get the puppies. We get the puppies. Booyah. Kind of excited for that. So we're in France. Next one, I don't know where this is. Somebody tell me where this is. I think this is Greece or Turkey is my guess. This is definitely Italy and this is Spain. So uh, definitely, definitely excited for this. But anyways guys, I'll see you guys in the next part. This has been Pichini's 88, over and out.